Good morning, day two of our tour, Extreme Ride for Hunger. Welcome, please remember to like, follow on our social media pages. At this moment, the beginning of day two, we are about to have uh, the cyclists already. A roll call has just been done. And by the way, these cyclists are here They've taken off the, the, from their work. They've paid to be here and be part of the store. Filled with events where they can demonstrate to various communities along the road how much they care for them. How you can be part of this. Follow us throughout the day and discover how you can be part. Have a good day. Today was the second day um, of the Ride for Hunger. Um, it was a really good day, the wind was behind us, so we averaged quite a high speed. We averaged about 35 k's an hour. I think the group really worked, worked well together. Um, yeah, from yesterday really, everyone kind of knew what to do. Um, so it was, it was a good group dynamic. The sky was nice, I'm feeling good. The sun though, it was too hot, yeah. But I'm okay. Today's ride was better than yesterday's ride. Yeah, then today I enjoyed more than yesterday, yeah. Today was an absolute amazing day. We had traffic department leading us, which was very nice. We haven't had that before. We had awesome staff, backup staff, amazing people, amazing weather, the road was good, and a great bunch of riders. So today, everything was in our favor. We're here ahead of time was probably the best day that I've had in the four years that I've done it. Um, let's look forward to the rest of it and hopefully it goes as good. It's just a beautiful day, you know, we blessed um, weather, wind, tailwind and what more can I say, you know, something nice to eat at the stop. It's and been uh, a good journey thus far, we're on day two and as support staff I'm enjoying it, I'm driving the lead car and I'm enjoying keeping the cyclists safe and guiding them on the road and it's been fun. We are pleased to host the meal on wheels uh, to continue doing their good work and uh, we're pleased that they at least thought of us along their cycling, uh, which is uh, really to deal with the, uh, the issue of poverty that we know is a problem for not only the government, but for everyone and all stakeholders have got a role to play. Usually when we come, people say thank you. When are you coming again? Please give some more. The mayor said, next time I want to join you, help you, assist you. Together we can do more. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. 
I feel so honored uh, to be part of this initiative uh, where you just don't write for yourself but you also write to give back and you write to impact others. I think it is such a beautiful honor. Um, thank you Mills on Wheels. Thank yes. you um, all the riders because they paced us and they made sure which we arrive here on time. So, yeah. Whoa. At the end of day two, we are right here in Blumhoff, Boitemuelong district. The municipal mayor of Blumhoff and Christiana joined us together with the ward. We just shared 45 food parcels uh, with Gogos and with community members. A blessed day after 148 kilometers, uh, the cyclists are tired and yet they had the joyous experience of sharing and keeping the focus on communities. As you continue to watch and look out, like and share this daily information, you are most welcome to also donate to our special project. Remember to look out for Meals on Wheels, look out for a ra Extreme Ride for Hunger. May you experience the joy that we had as we say goodbye after day two from Blumhoff.